At some point of our lives, all of us need mentors. Mentors have a way of looking at traits and picking traits that we ourselves are not aware of. But then we have a choice in picking our mentors, choosing our mentors. And in the many streams of life, when we meet so many different people, there are some people who stay with us. The beauty about mentors is we choose our mentors. And who are mentors? Usually people who are specialists in their space of work. In the journey of your career, there are five traits that you can work around. First one, make sure your mentor is a specialist. There could be one area where you are not very good, you still are in the learning process. And if you find somebody around you who's extremely good at it, pick them, choose them as your mentor and request them whether they would choose to mentor you. Because choosing somebody who's a specialist means this person is constantly on the lookout of upping his or her knowledge. And therefore, the second trait that you have to remember is this person should be adaptable, flexible, and open to learning. The curiosity factor should be very high. The third thing to remember while you choose your mentor is each one has a sense of style. So don't be biased by the way they talk or the way they dress. As long as they're giving you what you're seeking, choose that person for who he or she is. Unconscious or conscious biases sometimes deny us the pleasure of having the mentorship of amazing people. Don't allow that to come in. Because styles could be styles of talk. Some people speak in capsules and some people are verbose. Whatever, as long as that person is good at what he's doing, don't allow biases to creep in. Fourth, make sure that you choose a mentor who's also willing to listen and learn. It's very important in this journey because as long as the mentor is curious, you will progress. And sitting with a curious mentor means both of you learn in the process. Yes, he's a specialist in certain things, but there could be many others that he doesn't know about. But if he's willing to learn, it will only make you that much more expanded in your knowledge. And five, and most important, choose someone you can trust. It's approachable, very easy to talk to, somebody you can confide in, you can be vulnerable, who provides that safe space. Because finally, it is the mentor you choose who in a big way shapes your journey onward. So remember these five points whenever you are on a search for a mentor. All the best on that chair.